Hey YouTube, welcome back. So uh, today I'm going to uh, unbox uh, this. This one is the Enchir Vertical uh, Climber Indoor and uh, Folding Climber Exercise Machine for Home Gym Fitness. Compact uh, rocking climbing machine with adjustable uh, height and uh, LCD uh, display. So I would like to give the shout out to Nancy from the marketing team for sending me this so I get to the, this uh, review. So uh, this one uh, offer a full uh, body uh, workout. You can uh, work on your arms, abs, glute, your back, thigh, and uh, knee. And uh, this one will allow you to uh, adjust leisure or tension uh, six position depends on your strength. So it is uh, totally uh, portable for home, office, or travel. And it is made up of uh, alloy uh, steel material, which is uh, very uh, sturdy, lightweight, and uh, has a long uh, lifespan, and it is safe. After you fold this, you could uh, store away by putting by the wall or any uh, corner or uh, under the bed. So the LCD uh, screen would uh, track your time, speed, distance, and uh, carry burned. And uh, maximum uh, load capacity, it could uh, hold up to 350 pounds. Package uh, weigh about 44.09 pounds. So the product size is 39.4 uh, inch by 26.8 inch by 78.8 inch. So they have uh, two uh, different color, blue or uh, blue and black. So anyway, be sure to uh, check out the link that is currently showing within the description so you could uh, check this out. Anyway, let's go and then uh, unbox uh, this. You got an instruction manual right here, how to set it up. And I uh, come with the hardware and then uh, tools, which is nice. And uh, it says made in China. So this is the base. And then there's another one here.
the handle with a nice uh, foam uh, grip. Here's the hardware plus a tool kit and uh, got some of the washer and nuts and then the pins. I'm gonna move this uh, back to the carpet area so you don't really, uh, crack my tiles. Alright, so let's go ahead and uh, set this up. So uh, it should look like this. All right, so we're gonna uh, need for this uh, bolts, washer, and then for the nuts. That's for the base. So make sure the display is in the front. And then the curvature is toward the front. Oh no, my bad, it's this way. <laughs> Make sure you get the big piece. I'm sorry, you don't need to remove this. Make sure you put the big one onto the main one. And then the bolt is from the bottom up. Washer. And then the nut. Use a tool.
And then we do it for uh, this one, the bass. And then we got two of this uh, washer or uh, two of this uh, bolts. And this is with the Allen key. Okay? And you need these two nuts. And these are the pin. That's it. And uh, there are five of this uh, adjustment position that you can use this uh, black uh, ball pin, okay?
over here. And then you can remove this uh, bottom pin to fold it. Alright, so it's a LCD uh, display right here. And you got this uh, nice uh, rotor over here. On both sides. And these are the rubber uh, bumper. This is where you adjust it. Five different uh, position. So this is the pin that you need to remove. And once you fold it, you're going to put it into this position and then lock it back up. So I think I need to do some adjustment right here because somehow this uh, hole is not allowing me to push this pin in, okay? And there is like a chain to allow you to go up and down. Well, yeah, anyway, uh, hopefully you guys uh, give a thumbs up and then uh, like the video. Please uh, be sure to uh, hit the subscribe button, turn on the bell for notification, or drop any other comments on below. And uh, thank you for watching. I'll see you guys on the next uh, video. Bye, always. Peace.